Putting it very simply, that's what we're good at. We're good at things that bounce. If a small business is a world leader of things that bounce, you're probably thinking balls. But SunPower Incorporated of Athens, Ohio, doesn't make balls. This high-tech firm makes machines with internal structures that bounce. That piston being connected to a crank mechanism to make it go up and down, we resonate that piston so it, it bounces on a spring up and down and pumps a gas or as part of a sterling machine. In fact, SunPower specializes in sterling engines. The original sterling engine was invented in the 18th century by Robert Sterling, a Scottish minister, who was trying to find a safer alternative to steam engines. Likewise, SunPower's founder, William Beale, also wanted to make a better machine. So in the 1960s, he invented the free piston sterling engine. Over the years, the firm has expanded into different technology areas, and along the way, they've partnered with NASA. With a Small Business Innovation Research, or SBIR contract from Glenn Research Center, the firm built an oscillating flow test rig. That program was enormously successful in that it created engineering correlations, engineering rules of thumb that are used by us, or used by NASA, or used by our competitors. Um, and that rig still runs today. SunPower currently uses the rig to do testing for NASA. Through an SBIR award from Goddard Space Flight Center, the firm developed the cryo coolers for NASA's RESI satellite. The cryo coolers are based on the Stirling engine technology and help to cool sensors on the satellite. Launched in 2002, the satellite is monitoring solar activity. With an SBIR Phase 3 award, SunPower is working with the Glenn researchers to develop a light bulb size engine that could potentially be used as a power source for space applications. As well as the continuation of the SBIR, we have a separate program that's focused precisely on that field, which is Stirling engine generating electric power in space using plutonium as a heat source. That is a three-year program, close to $10 million program, and um, really demonstrates state-of-the-art efficiency, state-of-the-art, small size, um, state-of-the-art reliability and life. The United States Army and the Defense Advanced Research Projects Agency, or DARPA, are funding programs to develop the small engine as a possible portable power source for troops in the field. Through licensing, some of the firm's technologies have found their way into the commercial marketplace, making certain refrigerators and portable coolers much more efficient. Today, SunPower focuses on developing engine technologies for space. By making things that bounce, and in keeping with a philosophy begun by Robert Sterling, the firm will continue to make better machines for a better world.